it's me. Before I show you my sling, which recently molted, look at this. It's a darkling beetle. These are the beetles mealworms are going to be. And yes, it looks like it's dead, but it's not. I don't know what's up with this, but it always flips over. Yeah, you see? So it's alive. <laughs> But if I look after an hour, it flipped over again. And as long as the skin is not hardened completely, I will try to feed it. I think I will give it to Bruno, our big tarantula. And here you see what I just told you. My Tlilto cattle Vagans has molted. I can show you a little clip, because I was able to film it. And I was able to film how the tarantula flipped over after the mold. I have never noticed it myself, but this time I was able to notice it. And I'm able to show it to you. Great, yeah. Now the sling is stretching, which they always do after their mold. And yeah, this one has become so huge it's unbelievable it's the third mold right now here you see that was a mealworm too and right in the middle you see like a crack that's indicating that the darkling beetle will hatch today oh yeah and the reason why i want to try to feed this darkling beetle is that it seems like at least that's what I read on the internet. Some tarantulas eat those and some just don't. So I was not able to get like a clear answer whether they eat it or not. And yeah, I would say let's try it. I know that it will be just a little snack for Bruno. But let's see whether he eats the duckling beetle. Whoa, he did not hesitate for a second. He immediately grabbed the darkling beetle. Thank you for this great takedown. Look at this beautiful boy <laughs> munching a darkling beetle. So it looks like I can tell you, you can feed your tarantulas. Darkling beetle, as long as it is not hardened, so as long as it is not black, I would say, because it could get into trouble with the fangs because the beetle is very hard if it's black. But like I showed you, the brown color or in the beginning the white color, that's not a problem at all. Thanks, Bruno, for being part of this experiment. I hope you could learn something new. Thanks for watching and see you next time.